Baik, saya ingin menginformasikan kembali kepada Bapak-Bapak dan Ibu-Ibu nanti selama webinar diperkenankan untuk uh, menulis pertanyaan di kolom Q&A ya. Jadi di kolom Q&A ini Bapak-Bapak dan Ibu-Ibu bisa menuliskan pertanyaan bila ada sesuatu yang kurang jelas selama webinar. Nanti di akhir sesi presentasi kita akan coba jawab pertanyaannya satu persatu. Kalau misalnya ada pertanyaan lebih dari satu pertanyaan, silakan saja taruh di kolom Q&A ya. Jangan ditaruh di kolom chatting, supaya kita lebih mudah untuk filter pertanyaannya. Dan oh, untuk pertanyaan terpilih, nanti kita ada hadiah, Pak, Bu, voucher masing-masing seratus ribu rupiah untuk dua uh, orang penanya terpilih ya. Oke, hey, kita akan mulai webinarnya. Oke, okay, Mr. Amit and Mr. Amol, I would like to inform you that we will start the webinar ya. So, oke. Okay. Oke, okay, Mr. Amit. Thank you, Mr. Amit. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Selamat siang Bapak-bapak dan Ibu-ibu sekalian. Kami ucapkan terima kasih karena sudah meluangkan waktunya nih di siang hari ini untuk bergabung di webinar yang Asia Pacific selenggarakan hari ini. Jadi di webinar ini kita akan berbicara mengenai vokensi robot. Ya temanya itu mengenai simulate robot application program any industrial robot with one simulation environment. Jadi nanti kita akan melihat presentasi dari speaker kita yaitu Mr. Amit dan Mr. Amol mengenai work and see robot yang bisa membantu pekerjaan Bapak yang terutama yang sehari-hari nih dalam proses produksinya menggunakan uh, robot ya baik itu untuk pick and place maupun mungkin untuk uh, camp menggunakan bantuan robot ya kalau mungkin sebelumnya Bapak-Bapak dan Ibu-Ibu mengenal kami ya kami sering mengadakan seminar secara offline tapi memang karena keadaan seperti ini agar kami tetap terhubung dengan bapak-bapak dan ibu-ibu dan juga mengupdate teknologi terbaru dari software desain yang kami distribusikan, kami mengadakan webinar. ya Ini adalah webinar series yang kami selenggarakan ke sekian kalinya. Jadi saya juga ingin memperkenalkan uh, di webinar kita kali ini, kita kedatangan speaker dari Hexagon, ya, yaitu Mr. Amit Dere dan Mr. Amol. Oke. Okay. Saya juga akan coba perkenalkan diri juga nih. Saya adalah Dwi Darsono. Kebetulan saya technical manager dari ACA Pacific untuk manufacturing solution. Saya akan coba jelaskan sedikit mengenai profile company profile dari ACA Pacific. Jadi kita ACA Pacific adalah perusahaan distributor IT regional ada di lima negara. Kita ada di Thailand, Malaysia, Singapura, Australia dan tentunya kita juga ada di Indonesia ya. Kantor kami ada di Jakarta di 19 Kuningan Jakarta Selatan. Jadi kalau Bapak-bapak dan Ibu-ibu lihat di sini kami sebagai uh, regional IT distributor sudah cukup lama ya bermain uh, di level regional ini sudah sekitar 30 tahun lebih dengan total staff di seluruh regional sampai 180 lebih staff dengan channel partner kami lebih dari 30 ribu dan uh, customer kami lebih dari 108 ribu 180 ribu oke okay. kami juga pada kesempatan kali ini ingin coba memperkenalkan software apa saja sih yang kami distribusikan jadi ini adalah sedikit software yang kami distribusikan kebetulan karena kami dari Divisi desain jadi yang kami akan display di sini hanya produk-produk desain yang mungkin juga sebagian dari produk yang Bapak lihat ini familiar atau sudah Bapak gunakan. Jadi kalau nanti ada kendala ataupun ada upgrade yang ingin Bapak lakukan silakan kontak kami. Jadi kami di sini ada SketchUp, kami distributor satu-satunya SketchUp di Indonesia. Kalau Bapak-Bapak mungkin belum tahu SketchUp, SketchUp ini software desain yang sangat mudah digunakan, yang sangat banyak sekali user base-nya, terutama dari kalangan arsitektur ya. Kalau Bapak-Bapak lihat tuh di brosur, atau ada animasi dari developer perumahan ya, yang mau jual rumahnya, 
Nah itu modeling dan animasinya biasanya dilakukan di uh, SketchUp. Tapi beberapa part mungkin renderingnya menggunakan bantuan uh, software lain yaitu V-Ray. Kebetulan kami juga distributor dari produk Chaos Group yaitu V-Ray. Kami juga distributor dari PTC. Kalau bapak-bapak tahu mungkin dulu pernah kenal namanya Pro Engineer. Ya, Pro Engineer namanya sekarang Creo di bawah perusahaan namanya PTC. Nah, kami single distributor uh, PTC di Indonesia. Kami juga distributor dari ZWCAD juga BrickCAD. Ya, ZWCAD dan BrickCAD ini adalah software DWG alternatif. Ya, jadi misalnya bapak-bapak pengen punya software CAD DWG ya, 2D atau pengen CAD-nya juga bisa 3D, tapi lisensinya mungkin yang sekarang subscription, pengen ganti ke yang permanen, nah kita ada solusinya, ada ZWCAD, ini untuk yang OS-nya di Windows, tapi kalau bapak-bapak mungkin bermain lebih ke arah engineering, sorry, lebih ke arah arsitektur, engineering construction, bisa pakai BrickCAD, ini support di Windows, support di Mac dan juga Linux. Jadi kalau bapak-bapak pengguna Linux, ibu-ibu pengguna uh, Apple ya, ini bisa pakai BrickCAD. Dan juga kita tentunya distributor dari Hexagon. Ini adalah salah satu perusahaan di mana produk yang kali ini dipresentasikan di bawah Hexagon yaitu WalkNC untuk modul robot ya. Kita juga ada uh, Graphisoft Archicad ini software uh, desain untuk untuk teknologi yang mungkin bapak-bapak tahu yaitu building information modeling. Nah ini Archicad kita distributornya juga. Kita ada Leica ini laser scanner pak untuk menangkap objek uh, tiga dimensi, terutama untuk yang volumenya besar atau areanya besar seperti perumahan, tanah uh, dan lain-lain. Kita juga distributor untuk produk Epson ya Epson printer ya kalau bapak-bapak mungkin di rumah ada. Uh, printernya mau upgrade tintanya juga bisa menghubungi mau beli tintanya juga bisa hubungi kita kita ada plotternya juga ada proyektor ada printer label dan produk Epson lainnya tentunya juga kita terakhir adalah distributor dari 3D printer Rise 3D ini adalah uh, 3D printer industrial grade dengan volume mencapai 305 kali 305 kali 600 jadi cukup besar dan kalau bapak-bapak dan ibu-ibu search di Google, ini adalah 3D printer, best 3D printer untuk large format versi all 3DP ya. Di sini juga kita sudah menggunakan teknologi dual extruder sehingga bisa melakukan proses printing lebih dari satu material. Oke, sekali lagi saya ingin informasikan di webinar kali ini kami membuka kesempatan kepada bapak-bapak dan ibu-ibu untuk bertanya di kolom Q&A. Jadi selama webinar berlangsung, kalau ada pertanyaan yang mungkin materi yang disampaikan oleh narasumber kurang jelas, silakan put di kolom Q&A. Nanti kita akan coba jawab pertanyaannya satu persatu di akhir sesi. Dan tentunya kita akan berikan seratus ribu rupiah masing-masing ya untuk dua orang penanya terpilih. Oke, tanpa berpanjang lebar lagi, I will, without further ado, I would like to Uh, welcome Mr. Amit and Mr. Amol as a speaker for this webinar. So Mr. Amit and Mr. Amol, this is your time to do presentation. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Dwi. Uh, can you make me host? Yeah. Uh, I already configured okay. that okay. you can share directly. Okay. Okay. Mr. Dwi, do you see my screen? Yes, absolutely. Okay. okay. Hello, everybody. 
this is Mr. Amol Devkar working as an application engineer in Hexagon Production Software. So before start our session, I requesting all to please mute yourself. And if you are having any kind of doubts in between, you can text me in the chat box. So welcome you all to the webinar session on automation for industrial robot with work and see robot. We Hexagon as a global leading company, let's have a quick review on our presence in global market. So on the screen, blue color indicates our direct presence, whereas the dark gray color indicates our reseller presence only. So we are having development teams based in UK, Italy, France, Netherlands, India, and Russia. Almost 830 plus employees are working with us, among which 200 plus engineers are engaged in research and development. Our total revenue is around 140 plus million euros. So with this all, we all are proud to be a hexagonian. And we can say we are the world's number one CAM providers. Now let's have a quick review on CAM market analysis report provided by the SIM data. If you see here, we are having highest share values among all CAM industries. Here we are having almost 22.0 percentage share values. Now if we consider the number of seats installed and the revenue generation, we are far ahead from our competitors. So this makes us world's number one CAM centric software company. At Hexagon Production Software, we are having a very strong product portfolio. We are having number of CAD CAM softwares. The first one, the HCAM, which is a production CAM software, mostly using for milling, turning, and mill turn applications. Then work and see, which is also CAM software and it is used for 2D to 5 axis milling and which is mostly used in die and mold applications. Then cabinet vision is the software for cabinet and case goods designers and manufacturers. In the Rodan, which is also CAM software for sheet metal, fabrication and logistics. VG, which is a CAD CAM software for mold and die design and manufacturer. Then Alpha Cam, which is also CAM software, and it is specially designed for woodworking, metal, and stone cutting applications. Then uh, NC Simul, which is Z code verification and optimization software. Then Work Work Plan, which is MES software for ERP and project management. And you can see the smart which is a 3D weaving, planning and the CAM software for die build stamping industries. Then Work Explore, which is a software for 3D CAD data analysis. Then Work NC Dental, which is a specially designed software for dental applications. Then Work NC Robot, which is again the robot simulation and robot programming software. Now uh, let's start with the software we gathered for that is work and see robot the robot simulation and robot programming software before moving ahead let's see some challenges which we are facing in current situation due to COVID-19 we know we are having a huge previous order backlogs due to this large lockdown as well many of our skilled engineer migrated so obviously we are facing the lack of skilled man manpower issue then in this situation we need to minimize the human interactions so it is the fact to go for automation 
then in the tough time customer is also demanding the very fast delivery very lower cost and the better quality product in the lesser time to deal with such a situation we need such a tool where we can overcome these challenges and here is the work nc robot best option for that now we'll see why the most of automation industries are preferring the work nc robot software here in this software it is very easy to create the cell layout which will be exactly similar to the existing cell on the shop floor many robots are available in the default library even we can manage the external access which may turntable which may rails even we can customize our own robot with their joint values both the configuration that is tool on hand or part on hand of the robot can be done very easily for all robot brands the post processor database is available in the work nc robot software even if the customer knows the python language he can also the customize his own post processor for his robot then very important part that is the online help we are having the very large help tutorials data available for all kind of applications for the robots the work nc robot software is mostly popular in all kinds of business sector for the automation so you can see here the work nc robot is majorly used in automotive aerospace defense oil and gas even in medical business sectors now let's see some applications where we can support the first one is machining work nc robot can support for all kind of machining application that is the robotic machining applications then the welding then painting as well we can support for machine tending even material handling that is nothing but the pick and place applications even we can support for additive manufacturing is nothing but the 3d printing application and the last one that is robotic inspection so here you can see these many applications are supported by work nc robot now uh, let's see some features of work nc robot software so basically it is integrated module is nothing but work nc and robotic integration then the management of all cell element can be done that is we can change the position orientation of any element in the cell with respect to robot base then we are having the collision detection and the singularity detection inbuilt tool we can customize all kinds of post processor for all applications even we can redefine the head orientation of the tool for particular operation there is a supplementary linear or a rotational axis management that means we are having the inbuilt database for linear and rotational axis for a respective robot even we can import the external cad model and create the mechanism accordingly for linear and rotational axis now uh, let us see the work nc robot workflow as earlier explained the work nc robot is integrated module of work nc and the robot solver that is robotdk in the work nc module generally the cad file is imported and 
proper toolpath according to the application is going to apply over the CAD model with the help of this work NC software. The toolpath is nothing but the milling toolpath with the proper milling parameters. Then this toolpath is transferred to this robot solver environment where already the robot cell is developed. Then these toolpaths are going to verify with the help of this robot decay solution. In this, the collision checking, the robot simulation, these things are taken care. After all, the robot program is generated through this robot solver. This way, the work and see robot work out as an integrated module. Now, let's go through the video which will explain betterly how we are carried out the robot programming in work and see robot module. So this is work and see environment where we have created the proper toolpath according to our requirement. So here you can simulate the toolpath here it is in yellow color this is a toolpath so this toolpath is to transfer in work and see robot environment so this is transferred is exported and now this is a toolpath in which we have given the proper base values now post processing the toolpath into robotic environment so it is post processed now the simulation now we are simulating the toolpath into this work and see robot environment so here you can see the cell layout is already created so here the task is to simulate and verify the robot program so here we are optimizing the program selecting with the proper tool so it is updated and now you can see the simulation of the robot so here we have selected the fanuk robot even we can adjust the speed of the simulation here on the bottom side you will get the cycle time for this simulation or this machining so here you can adjust the speed for the simulation now the task is to generate the robot program as we have selected the fanuk robot so we'll go through the post processors available in our database so from that database we'll select the fanuk robot post processor and accordingly we will generate the robot program and the program will be in dot ls format as fanuk robot required you can see here the program is generated that is of dot ls format now uh, let us see some strengths of work and see robot so first one it is easy to use if you see the work and see robot graphic user interface offers easy rapid and precise program Ming resulting into the generation of complex toolpath for all types of materials and machines. Then the simple programming process allows manufacturers to realize the full potential of their robots. All work and see strategies like a three axis, three plus two axis, or simultaneous five axis can be employed to fulfill all the various manufacturing jobs such as milling, part cutting, etc. with equipment available in the shop floor. 
the work and see robot replaces the point to point learning cycle for part trimming now the second work and see robot strength that is having the strong simulation tool in this to verify the simulation the software needs the precise cad model of the robot cell so with this we can detect the eventual collision between the different elements such as the robot the tool changer magazine the table or the supports and supplementary accesses and the safety barriers in short if we are having the precise cad model with us so definitely we can avoid the collision on the shop floor the next strength is trajectory optimization and singularity trajectories can provoke the singularity problem in robot wrist and arms so we can see robot can automatically detects the potential singularity condition in trajectories and warns operator so that they can take the proper action then the simulation inside the robot applications allows robot movements to be optimized the module offer robot configuration or complementary positions to ensure the optimized trajectories high trajectory precision guarantees top quality finished product so this way the work and see robot is very useful to avoid the singularity and optimize the trajectory now uh, let us see the different cell processes or the configurations available in work and see robot the first one is tool mounted robot in tool mounted robot configuration basically the tool is mounted on the hand of the robot so a tool mounted robot cell configuration allows the machining or the application of various processes on very large part and heavy parts so this process offers the possibility of changing tools or machining equipments on the robot so here we can use um, different tool magazines so this way the tool mounted robot workout in upcoming video we will be very much clear how exactly work and see is suitable for tool mounted robot kind of configuration
just now we have seen the video of tool mounted robot now let's come to the next part that is part mounted robot in this situation the part is mounted over the robot that means the tool is external and the part is in hand of the robot so such a type of solution is proposed for serial production purpose on a smaller part it is limited by the robot capacities this process allows the automated cell to be controlled from loading blanks onto the conveyor belt to complete the machining and placing the part back on the conveyor belt so to understand this let's have one more actual cutting video where you can observe the part mounted robot kind of configuration Just now we have seen how strongly the work NC robot can support for different kind of robot configurations that is part in hand or it may a tool in hand. Now let us see the kinematics. So work NC robot can pilot any type of robot from 4 to 7 axis that means even we can customize our own robot if we are having the proper values for joints even we can customize the supplementary axis such as rotating tables rail mounted robots gantries with the three linear axis if these are not available in our standard database working c robot offers a library with 250 plus existing machines from over 22 supplies and if we need to customize our own external access then with the help of CAD data we can create our own mechanism with the help of this kinematics this way the work and see robot can support for modifying or building mechanism or the robot
Here I'll show you some external kinematics prepared in work NC robot. So here you can see this is the kinematics for rail mounted robot. You can observe the rail and the robot. The robot is mounted over the rail. So this way we can create our own mechanism. So this is a mechanism created with the help of the CAD data. So CAD data is imported in work NC robot environment and created the mechanism for external access. So here you can see the simulation for the same. You can simulate the robot and you can observe the motion or moments of this external access. So this way we can work out even we don't have the standard uh, rails. So this way we can customize our own rails. Now uh, we have seen how to create a custom rails or external access or even the custom robots. Here in work NC robot you can see we are having almost 500 plus robots tools and external access available in our standard library. If you see here this is a robot library in this these are number of brands say KUKA, FANUK, Motoman, ABB these mean that, mean that means all kinds of brands are available in work NC robot even they are <coughs> defined by access, payload, reach capability, repeatability or payload capacity. With this filter also you can select the robot. Here on the screen you can see these are some robots I have shown here. These are of ABB brand. So this way the work and see robot supports all kinds of standard robots. These are readily available in work and see robot library. The post processor database. The work and see robot post processor configurable according to the production facilities. Creates the program which is pilot all type of robots considering all possible parameters. So in work and see robot you can see these many controllers are supported. So the Stabuli, the ABB, Fano, Yasakawa, Motomat and KUKA. These post processor are readily available in our post processor database. Even you can see here, these are the different kind of post processors available that is ABB, Allen Bradley, these are the controllers, let's say Fano, then Kawasaki, KUKA, these are uh, de depends on the different types of the controller we have. So this way you can see the work NC robot strongly supports all kind of post processor for all kinds of robots according to the applications. Now the next part is post processor customization. Work NC robot having added advantage to customize the post processor using Python language. So even the standard post processor can be customized according to the functional requirement. So it is very easy to customize the post processor in work NC robot using Python language it can be easily done. So the customer who knows the Python language so he can also customize his own post processor for his robot according to his requirement. So this is one of the best added advantage that we can customize the post processor for any robot. Let us see some customers who are using our robotic solution. On the screen you can see these are the customers from startup to the worldwide largest companies using robotic solution. So the Airbus NASA basically NASA is using for inspection purpose you can see this on our portal 
then L3 Technologies, CAT, 3M, Thyssen Group, Renault, Rockwell Automation. Basically, this is automation company in robotics. Then Siemens, Fraunhofer, Samsung, Nestle, Canon. So these are the companies who are using our robotic solution for their automation. Now uh, it's time to conclude our session. So thank you all of you for attending the webinar on automation for industrial robot with the work NC robot. In the webinar, I tried to cover all the points, but if you are having any kind of doubt, so you can contact to this provided contact details on the screen. You can contact to Mr. Bang Bang, Mr. Amit, even you can contact to Mr. Dwi or Mr. Amol, that is me. For more product details, don't forget to visit our website that is www.workenc.com or www.robodk.com. Thank you. Thank you all of you. Thank you. Hello, Mr. Dwee. Hello, Mr. Ahmed. Yeah, so, so I will stop will... sharing. Okay. So we will open session of question and answer. We have already many questions, Mr. Amol and Mr. Ahmed. Look like uh, audience uh, very interested with the so where let's see the question first um yes uh, mr d uh, you please yes. uh, take the question one by one we'll try to okay. answer them maybe because the question is to much we will just uh, select several questions yeah, to answer in the session after for the question which we cannot answer in the session we will email you one by one yeah pa Bapak-bapak uh, dan ibu-ibu nanti kalau ada pertanyaan yang belum bisa kita jawab di sesi ini mungkin karena waktunya juga udah mulai limit nih ya. Jadi kita akan seleksi beberapa pertanyaan ya. So the first question coming from Pak, where is it? Pak Zul Husni Siregar. Uh, I'm also, the question is, does the robot software work 100% correct or does it slip occasionally? And when it miss, it must be reset or something uh, like what? Okay, that's the question. Um, yes, 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 Mr. D. Uh, so I already uh, answered for this question. Um, so uh, this software is 100% uh, proven software. So uh, we will not find such a things in the software. The, whatever the program is uh, generated in the software, the 100% it will be a similar. It will be exactly similar on the shop floor itself. There will be no any single change in the program, or you will get exact um, things, exact motion of the robot until and unless the robot is precise. Or the robot is having very good accuracy. Okay, thank you, Mr. Amol. So there is question also. Does the software does the software support for welding robot from OTC Daihan? Daihan. Um. Yes. Yes. Of course, uh, Mr. Dwi. Uh, you can. Uh, uh, that uh, which are the robot brands uh, we, we are supporting. So even you can share this screen, uh, the different uh, robot. 